Alright. Uh, just woke up. And I, the other night, was watching Chase play the game. And one of these places, one of these catacombs, probably that one. I think it's that one. Those things that fall down have a hallway in them that lead to another s stone sword, as well as an ash of war. twice to heal once. Ah, uh, I hate this game. Big numbers means difficult. It has way too much HP, way too much poison, way too much damage. That's difficulty right there. Don't bother trying to play a game from the past, like Ghosts and Goblins, where you can kill stuff in like one or two shots. Artificial difficulty is what pisses me off. I don't want an easy mode for this game. I just want it to be better balanced. Like, those guys are retarded. They have too much of everything. I genuinely feel this DLC was not playtested. And also, why are there two bonfires? Like, what is this? They're just placing them everywhere or nowhere. Either get two or none. I'm assuming that's the door. That reminds me, he also found a magic reason I don't think I did. Yeah. He found the super magic grease. And I didn't. So I gotta go back. Uh, here, probably. thing is there, so maybe I'll go up first. Definitely gonna watch the rest of Chase's, because he'll probably go to where Mesmer is, and then find the path for me, because he'll have his stupid Twitch chat go, Oh, it's right here! Do this, do that! He also did the thing that I was complaining about, where someone's like, Where'd you find the Great Katana? And he's like, Oh, I'll just I'll open up my map and point it out for you. Here you go, it's right there. Like, they could scroll back, dude. It's episode one, stream one. Scroll back if you want to know where. Why are you watching it from the middle? Go to the beginning. Why are you watching a playthrough from the middle? What the hell? Oh, it's because it's live, and I gotta, get, I gotta be there for the live. No, you don't. wrong my audio is too high now at a better volume setting
Ah, oh, fatty, I didn't get a fight last time because I just didn't bother. Wow, that could actually frostbite. It's insane. <sighs> also Chase is starting the fucking DLC at level 130 like I did but he had literally a million HP or uh, <coughs> a million souls god damn it but also a butt ton of HP he had 60 plus somehow he's getting up to 270 or some two, 2070 2700 or something like that with just the two talismans, but I swear to god they don't kill that high with those two talismans. You get them like 99, so I don't know what the fuck's going on there. He takes like no damage when he gets hit, which also bothers me. It's like, am I playing a different version? Was there a day one patch and he just didn't get it? I didn't mention this, but when I did watch Prods, I noticed that he has 99 of every item. I think Chase does as well. Which means they're using the save at it. The save at it error. Glad my roll went off. Glad 
that one didn't. And I'm glad that his attack speed is exactly enough to beat the shit out of you. And I'm glad all my momentum went away when I did this show. Is this the correct direction? It thinks a lot. Genuinely garbage game. That's the thing that they're doing. <clears throat> I never got the holy thing. Fatty? No, you're just a guy. garbage they really shouldn't have bothered making any more spirit summons because they make tears just too good it's like the player but not garbage imagine if player had the appropriate stats for area Uphill and then hit me also through walls.
I'm going to follow me backwards. I want to see what the other path is. Oh, you fell down. Maybe I don't want to see what the other path is then. Must have been some broken stairs or something. Yep. Although it looks like I'm supposed to jump down. Thanks a lot, game. I love it when you're garbage. And then raise me more. on to the guy that I'm looking at. Thanks for stealing my jump. Grave bird. What's it do? Oh my god. Oh. 
Why? Why did it steal it from me twice? This dog shit fucking game stole my fucking Ash of War twice! See, there's a giant sunflower weapon. You can get at some point. Yeah, players never use the colossal weapons, so we're gonna add a bunch more because. Oh wait, they're bad. Colossal weapons suck. Oh. What about colossal swords? Oh, those are good. Man. Bullshit. What a terrible game, dude. People love to wake up in the morning and get raped. Oh, I pushed you into a corner. Haha. -ha. This is just where you're going to be for the rest of your life. I have infinite poise, bitch. Infinite. No end in sight. This game is genuine trash. Nothing better than having your momentum just suddenly disappear. Myself, get to the fucking spell I want. Imagine just pressing like one or four to cast the spell you want. That'd be insane. Good thing games like that don't exist.
Mimic, I'm gonna watch you fight this guy. He dealt 14 thunder, and he can survive three hits. That's how much health I'm supposed to have. Also, I think I do a little bit more damage than Mimic here. Alright, I think I deal a lot more damage than Mimic here. Not really, he dealt 14 with a jumping attack, I dealt 15. Curve great sword. Or horn calling. What I need to do is go get that stupid farming sword. Sword. Where is the curved great swords? There they are. Obviously, should yes, have enough of that. They both require summoner. I guess that makes sense. Interesting.
Nice. It has the fucking R2s I like. That's awesome. No way. A massive range version of that. Oh, that's medium because... Okay. The person? Well, this isn't exactly the best weapon set up for a player fight. Why do I have no choice? Why do I have to kill Mikola? What's this? Summon the Moog Servant guy. Or summon a challenge Needle Knight Lita and her allies. So I have to fight all the player character type things? Who are gonna have... <sighs> retarded levels of fucking everything? Man, I don't know what to use then. Oh my god. Why? Why do I have to kill him? Why can't I side with Mikola? What a terrible game. No choice. You get no choices. Just go through and murder everybody you see the game.
terrible game. Not a lot of side with Mik Mikola. Somehow you end up siding with Moog by force. Who's dead, by the way? Dexterity Faith. Light great sword. Not allowed to attack here. Great, fantastic. And I killed all these people for no fucking reason. Still not allowed to attack. Allowed to attack. And you only get her chest piece and not her helmet. There also wasn't a bonfire. So. Just run back to it. I'm very, very unhappy with that. Thousand souls can level up once. Why am I not allowed to attack in this empty arena? Just a curved sword, not even a backward sword. And I go to Mikula, and it's like, oh, now you can side with them. I'm betting on it. I'm willing to bet. Righteous tarnished. That was an astounding battle, to be sure. Now I suppose this leaves only one, but in truth I cannot calm my quivering. Challenging a god is no small matter. Oh, something you want to get off your chest? Well, you needn't worry. It was you, wasn't it, who defeated Lord Moog? Fear not. I bear no grudge against you. His eminence was felled in an honorable duel. And such are the risks of seeking lordship. Besides, what right have I to complain? I blame the enchantment more than anything. Righteous tarnished. We will have our victory. I swear upon my blood. Uh-huh. Righteous tarnished. I swear. Why do I have to fight Mikola? Why can't we be friends? Why do I have to murder everybody? have this thought when I play this game that two wasn't enough.
loyal blade. And shouldn't we have talked to Mikola once, at least once? Both your deeds will ever be praised in song. Now, the vow will be honored, and my lord brother's soul will return, so that he may be oh. my consort. Small Radon. Why is there small Radon? Why is there small Radon? This is like... Why? I don't understand. Or is that Radon's soul? This game with a fucking passion. You get no time at all to do anything when you walk in. None. I hate this fucking game. It's like you walk into the fucking From Software fucking building and they just start beating the shit out of you. Everybody, for no reason. It's like, oh hey, kill him! This guy came to our building. No time to think, no time to do anything. You know, Melania walks at you for like a good 20 seconds. There goes those souls. I rolled, by the way. I don't know if you'd know that, but it's the, obviously the button I press. I guess I gotta walk in, wait for retard to attack him, then summon my retard and heal, then I can buff and fight him. Or whatever. I hate this game. I fucking hate this game. Oh, now you wanna walk. remains dude fucking stupid wizard guy do something you fucking faggot or just stand there and look at him do something so I can summon my fucking retard I rolled I hate this fucking game gives you no time at all ever And of course, dipshit here has infinite HP. I don't have Dragon Vest, so I can't rot him. Yep, yeah, just hold your hands up in the air. That's how you defeat the player. You move slowly. game can read that I'm pressing B over and over and over and over and over. Super hard command to confirm. Oh my god.
Yes, very long cutscene. Very much required. Posing. Is this Dragon Ball Z? We're gonna spend five minutes screaming, charging up? Come on, get to the fucking point, man. Lord Brother. What the fuck do you mean by that? Godwin? No. Radon's big again. Yeah, it's just the final boss of, uh... Then yield the path forward not to final us. boss, but the dude... The princes. What do you fucking mean by this, Radon? Like, the whole point was Mikula was trying to give back Godwin, and then it's like suddenly, yeah, actually, it's Radon. Radon, who was still alive and just fucking rotty. Like, what is this? Were they smoking crack when they made this fucking DLC? Let's forget everything we wrote and write something new. Somehow the other one doesn't deal any poise damage, and now I'm dead. You know what? I don't care. I'm not bothering with this. I'm gonna go try and figure out how to do the other stuff. And get more of the stupid black shit that makes my character stronger to the point where they aren't getting fucking raped by everything they fight. So I gotta figure out how the fuck to go all the way over here. I hate this game so goddamn much. I want to kill myself. This bitch is gone. Oh, she died trying to learn how to read. That's fantastic. She just dies there. Why? Kill myself. Uh, how the fuck do I go through this place and get get my way around it to explore the rest of the DLC? All this cut off content that I can't access. Is there something I missed back this way? There's got to be a way to go to the right. There's supposed to be a back door or something to go here. So it's just gonna be me wandering around like a fucking retard. No clue where to go to actually experience the rest of the DLC. <laughs> Why the fuck do we have to kill Mikolo? Why does the player get zero choices? Just kill, kill, murder, murder, murder. Did I go down this before? I don't remember doing that. But I had to have. Uh... 
But I absolutely don't remember doing this. Obviously I didn't because there's a fucking item right there. So pissed, dude. Why the fuck do we have to kill everybody? What is fucking Miyazaki's obsession with being a psychotic murderer? He's the type of person that starts the game and immediately attacks white mask retard. He's like, oh, I did not realize that that, that was not the, the purpose of character. You know, everyone's sad when Akira Toriyama died, and sad when the dude that wrote Berserk died. I'll be happy when Miyazaki dies. Because he's fucking retarded. He's the lead director of the game, so everything bad is his fault, literally. That's how Japanese games work. The guy in charge makes all the decisions. Everything bad is on their shoulders. The same like a Western game. You can't blame... Last of Us 2 being shit on Neil Druckmann. Alone. You can imply it. Yeah, thanks a lot. Rakshasa. I'm glad the bad guys just don't give a shit when they get hit. I want to kill myself. In case you're wondering, I don't actually want to kill myself. It's just something I can't help myself from fucking saying when I am upset or in a bad mood. It's like my go-to. I don't know why. Can't bleed him. Can you freeze a phantom? Is that your Ash of War? I'm glad my attack missed. I can't imagine how fun this game would be if it didn't always miss. Glad his stab attack that I would miss hits me because I'm player. I'm gonna kill myself, dude. Would you fuck right off and give me a chance to get the fucking full HP? I have to heal every time you attack me because if you attack me twice, I'm dead! And that's difficulty! Just one hit- Okay, now you gotta heal! Fuck you! Fucking bullshit. He has infinite poise during that. But when the player gets it, it'll have literally zero poise. Oh my god, game. Just move forward. I'm pressing forward. Jump forward. Keep the momentum. I have to play this game by only doing jumping attacks. Because everything else doesn't work. And even then, jumping attacks might not work. Because the shit fucking has infinite fucking... Like, his sword has a giant bubble around it. But when I have the sword, it's just the sword. And I have to land my stabs.
Text based. Cannot be changed. And apparently it was a blood weapon? I don't remember him even getting blood on me at all. Okay. They actually have something in this weapon that says you have more poise with this weapon because... And that guy was some sort of fucking blood land of reeds guy, but in medieval armor for whatever reason. Increases damage dealt, but greatly increases damage taken. That is false. He didn't greatly take more damage. He took expected damage. Too much. Takes forever to kill him. That's all bullshit, dude. Well, you're not taking into account that NPCs are literally level... 2,000, while the player can only reach level 700, and... Well, actually, Miyazaki expects everyone to be literally level 752, or whatever the fuck the maximum is, before even bothering to play the DLC. Why would you not? Why would you not? Thanks, game. Thanks for stealing my jump. Not like I fucking pressed the goddamn jump button, because I know you can't just turn around in these stupid horses! Remove the jump button! Doesn't work! This stupid fucking inventory. I hate everything. Now I'm gonna go kill this fucking hippo. And it'll drop nothing. It'll be like, why'd you bother, dumbass? You thought that boss would drop item? Are you stupid? Why would it do that? Why the fuck would it do that? Idiot. Dumbass. As if that grabbed me in the middle of my dodge. Yep, I rolled. This guy's not dealing much damage. It's kind of insane. This is exactly how every fight should be. No one. Oh, I was wrong. There was an item. I genuinely did not expect a reward. 
I have been conditioned not to. Now there's a second one. That explains why I didn't deal much damage. In case you have to fight them both. They actually did a good person idea. Well, now there's two, so, so they're a little bit weaker. Elden Ring is not a game you can play by yourself. You need something to distract you, to let you stay neutral, mentally. I shouldn't play this stupid fucking DLC anymore. Unless my friends are online, so I can actually not think about this fucking game and how terrible it is. negatively reviewing the game. Oh, it's too difficult. No, it's not difficult. It's annoying. It's bad. Big numbers isn't difficulty. I've played difficult games. And I genuinely can't name on any, any off the top of my head, which is funny. I don't know why I can't. I'm gonna look back. Also, most of them are from like PS1, PS2, so it wouldn't matter because everybody that see this video is like 10 years old. And they go, what the fuck's a PlayStation 1? I thought PlayStation 5 was the first one. You're telling me Xbox One isn't the original Xbox? What? What the fuck is an NES? I need to go get another cup of coffee. I'm still not even fully awake. Also, why the fuck is this... What? How the fuck have I been here? How? Am I gonna have to watch my own videos to see how the fuck I got here? There's gotta be a way to go like this. Jump to here and then climb up. Village of Flies has gotta be connected to this, going this way. This is absolutely the bottom of everything. Mm -hmm. Must have somehow missed the way up. 
Or am I supposed to drop down from up here? I need to go fucking get in the cup of coffee regardless. Probably gonna do a longer session of this. Today. This is the fly drop down place, so. There's no way this leads up, but also this led. It led down to here. And somehow here, or something. through that tunnel to the poison area. There's apparently a drop down from up there to here for whatever reason. Also, why are there sideways graves in the walls? Pause, yeah? Okay. <laughs> Looks like there are no sideways graves to get me down. There's a bonfire right fucking there. So I had... So I had... to have missed something inside this broken down place. That well looks like it might have a ladder in it. Rolling ahead. Yeah. Gotta be something ahead of me that I missed. In here. Don't you dare notice me. I know I came down here. Did I not go through this place or was it locked or something? Like Oh, thanks game. Just rip me off the ledge. I'm going to kill myself. Didn't realize I was playing Tenchu on the PS1. I got near a ledge and it's got ripped right the fuck off it. Why is there a random item right here? I don't understand this game at all, this DLC. You kill Mesmer, then you're allowed to go fight Mikola because for some reason you've got to go kill Mikola now. Why? No one knows. There's no fucking point to this story. You're invited here by Mikola and you're like, that's it, I'm going to kill him. Where are my souls? How the fuck do I get down? Like what?
Like, it looks like there's messages here that every is going down. But how the fuck did they do it? I feel like I might be able to drop there, but that rock will just slide me. This should be just within the range of falling. Like, it should honestly be. It was. I'm gonna kill myself. I hate this game. I fucking hate this fucking game. We've completely changed how falling works in the previous game, so now it's fucking weird. And there's three stage, uh, three, three heights of falling. You take no damage, you take a lot of damage, or you just straight up fucking die. No ramping up of anything to help you judge distances at all, ever. Oh my god. I'm so fucking unhappy playing this. When I first played Elden Ring, I enjoyed everything up to the Landale Capital. Everything past it was annoying. Not difficult, not even retardedly bad, like this is. I fucking saw videos where people are saying that they were stuck on fucking the Fire Giant, who's a joke of an enemy, like I don't understand. I just don't get this, man. I don't get anything. Random Hunam down there. <sighs> yeah, just steal what I'm trying to do. I want to kill myself. I think I had the butcher's knife. Okay, no item. I'm glad my shitty AI dude is just l 2 over and over and over and over and over. And over. That guy had the same omen head as the other guy. Except there was nothing wrong with his body, because don't you know, if you have a curse, it only affects your head. Bonnie butchering knife. That's fantastic. It's just the butcher knife again, so... Oh, it's a special version. Okay. It's the classic butcher knife. Is it an axe? Like a hand axe? That goes all the way with it? No. It 
that's hilarious. I wish people wouldn't leave dumbass messages, man. Just do something that's, you know, relevant. Not, oh, bird. I wish I had a bird. Ooh. Dog? Oh man, that's boosting my spectral steed's ability to deal damage. Wait a second, the spectral steed can't deal damage. No. Another idiot. There's too much grass. So I got two bridges to cross. Alright, whatever's this way. And maybe down. No, I don't think so. DLC is worth it just for that. I do wonder if Chase and Prod are both on drugs. And all those dudes. They're just so fucking happy all the time about everything. And I don't get it. I 
I don't know how people could just be happy. I mean, to be fair, they have people every day giving them hundreds upon hundreds of dollars. Tooth whip. Just do this, just do this. Still no strength whip. Poison whip, though. That's awesome. Ah, it's got that whip attack. Does that penetrate from shields, I wonder? I'm still holding out hope for a chain whip. Uh, just a chain. As a whip, strength characters. Maybe you can add a morning star at the end. I guess I don't know. It's up to you. It's one of those ones that moves. Mm. That's cool. I really wish I wasn't blind. Like, how am I not able to see the crossbow? That's a little bit further down. really goes to show just how well made the big base game of this is with how this DLC is just full of empty spaces everywhere big open nothing and this is what people want they want this they like to just ride around forever god it's so enjoyable to have a big open empty world I love empty world games So it makes Metal Gear Solid 5 so good is that you get in a car for 20 minutes to get to the objective. Whatever. Ugh. The fact that it spotted me pisses me off even more. Red 
is in the prayer curing the giant fire team. I don't understand. Why no Q? Why you no try Q? What do you mean annoying and have too much HP? What? No, we would never do that. No, uh-uh, mm-mm. But those things all drop tears. Don't you want to see the tears? Yeah, I'll just Google it. Whoa! It's impossible. <sighs> like any of the tears are any value. The one I've got is the most overpowered tier in the game. Free light roll. If only rolls worked, then it'd be even better than it already is. There's no way of changing the settings, by the way. You can't make it so B isn't sprint. You just have to dodge. I mean, you could probably mod the game. Someone probably did that. Where you could fucking make it so it's on press and not on let go. Most insufferable part of this game. Bad dodging system. All of them, really. Raboth's rise. Who the fuck is Raboth? Who are these people in their towers who we never get to see? Hmm? Well, it's gotta be named something. Can't be named nothing. Somewhere, spirit string has been unsealed. Okay, cool. Contraption does not move. Okay, I'm assuming there's a spirit string outside here. Yep. I swear I just saw like a lip at the very top. Rabath's cannon. Thank you, Rabath. Jar cannon wasn't strong enough, so here's another one that's even better. Look at that. Magic damage. And guide shots towards their target. Are you insane? There's a lip up there. I wonder what that's about. If you can drop down to it. I really wish there was a setting they added to completely delete player messages. So I hate seeing turtles, and then there just being messages around them. Because I guarantee you, half of them don't say dog. So I got two paths to go down. I'll go this way first. Because it's right here. I ripped off my horse. It 
Shadow Keep, Church of Dis Church District. Okay. Ah. Back around into here. And that's probably how I get to the other side of everything. Is that a fucking marionette? Oh my gosh. I already know there's gonna be nothing down here. This is... yep. Probably. Oh, uh, dude, a starlight shard. That's so crazy. fucking thing on the ground. That's weird. In case you're wondering, I was pressing Y as I was running over that acquire materials. The game just decided I didn't want also, for some reason, I can't attack in that grave. Cathedral of Madness Metire. Well, this is the dude from the trailer probably right yeah guy in the chair someone to talk to Slab Firefly. Fine. You just wander up behind him. All right, hello. Well, you don't often receive visitors. I am Ymir. Welcome to Man. You're Ymir. It is a pleasure to have you in lands so forsaken as these. Chance encounters are precious indeed. Seeing that we have convened here on this day, allow me to mark the occasion with a modest offering. 
a necklace key item and a map. Yeah, that's nothing. It's literally this. No, it's not. It's like a curl. It's not water. Curls up and to the to the right. Water that curls up and to the right. This water does not exist. Strange. <clears throat> Use that hollowed rune to sound a hanging bell. Uh, teleport spell. That's kind of stupid. I am a glintstone sorcerer. We study the stars and examine the life therein. Are you familiar with our findings? Long ago, we began as stardust, born of a great rupture far across the sky. We too are children. Is that not sublime? And yet, none can fathom its implications. Its utter brilliance. I guess I'll buy it. These are all literally the default stuff. Oh yes, do mind your feet. What? <laughs> okay. Crabs, water, a flooded city. It looks like we're going to be able to unflood it.
Sound comes from behind me, then in front of me. I wonder what sound was. Something in the water. Surely. It's over there, whatever it is. I know it's going to attack when I start jumping across these stupid trees. Or not. Is it going to attack me now? Is that an ulcerating tree spirit? Oh my god. guys. Hello. Poison, damn. I mean, I should have figured as much that I'd be coming across these guys again. Second tree spirit in the water. Isn't it? How are they alive down there? They're fucking trees. They'd be drowning.
Rare room key. America, mother to us all, favor me with thy grace. I have met many who would threaten or distress thee, and quelled each and all. And I hereby swear to never cease. So please grant me thy grace. Leave me with my solitary light. Queen Marika, I implore thee, bestow thy grace. Take not from me my solitary light. Decreed by the grace of Gaul. <sighs> no soul shall thy sanctity imperil. Okay. Why is that? It didn't hit me. That's probably the correct direction. I'm assuming if you gave him the other one, he'd just straight die or some bullshit. I could probably jump to that while the water's still here, but I'm not going to. How you get into the rest of this place?
<sighs> There's gotta be a way. All right, well, to drain the water. I think I found it. Just start shooting out of the wall. I mean, if there's a thing there, I can barely see it. Why aren't they open anyway? Why would they let this flood? And also, how many times would it have to rain to flood that much? Also, why would there need to be vents? Did, was it flooded on purpose? I don't understand. Is that really necessary? Look, there's a bonfire. No! It's the first bonfire I've ever seen. Holy shit. Alright, where are the dark wraiths at? Where is the hood? The hood at? Na -na -na -na. Oh, cool. So there's at least two ulcerating tree spirits down here that I have to kill. Can't wait. Shouldn't it be right here? Like, wasn't this where it was? Crap. You look different. you have appropriate damage. Like obey. Is that death blight? I think that is. That was a very delayed roll. What the fuck happened with that? Mantle of thorns. Why did I try to go to a horse? I need to go back up just to grab the thing that was on the thing.
Death Mask Helm. Uh huh. Statue. He reduces FP used to summon spirits, huh? Thanks, game. Thanks a lot. It. it just dodge rolls damage enemies. Yes. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and just split this recording. Bye!